Hello everyone. In this session, we will see how to create a book using financial reports. A book is a collection of multiple reports or snapshots or it can contain reports and snapshots. A book can also include URL links, third-party documents such as Microsoft Word, Excel, PowerPoint, PDF files, HTML files and text documents. Typically, a book is created when user wants to see multiple reports at once. So what is the requirement to see multiple reports? In any company, there are reports like balance sheet report, income statement report, expense reports. And if user wants to see all these reports together in one PDF file, in that situation, we can create a book. There is another scenario. For example, a report has user point of view for entity. When user selects one entity in the user point of view, only one report gets generated for that particular entity. What if user requires all entities report in one single document? We will see these two requirements now. Let's log into workspace to create a book. To create a new book, click file, open document, select collect reports into a book, click next. The reports that are available already appears on the left hand side. I am selecting income statement. Income statement prior month versus current month. Now click finish. New document appears here and user point of views appear here. At the top of this document, we see all user point of views. To save this book, click save or click file save. Let's save this document. The type of this document is financial reporting book. Enter a name for this book. You can enter a name as per your reporting requirements. I am entering MEP underscore actual. MEP is month and package. At the end of the month, all the required reports are sent in one document as a package. That's why we can also call this as month and package. Now go to explore, click refresh and to see the result of this book, right click on the book, click open in complete book in PDF. Now the user point of view appears at the top of this report. The first page contains table of contents and the book name here. The first report and its page number. The second report and the page number appears here. You can click on the page number to go to that particular report. This is our second report. So we can Collect multiple reports into single PDF file using a book. User can now select the entity, year and period as point of use. We can select only one entity at a time. We can save this book results as PDF by clicking the save button here and enter a name for this PDF file. Here is our exported PDF file which contains multiple reports. Now our next requirement is to use only one report to generate the same report for multiple member selections. Click File, New Document, select the option Collect Reports into a Book, click Next. This time I am selecting only one report called Income Statement. Click finish and in this document we have two user point of views and if you notice here there is an option called member selection. It says book point of view. In the bottom of this screen select book point of view and we will be able to select functions. Here we can select children of a member or descendants of a member or all members. Remove the selection book point of view from the right hand side. Now select descendants. 
click right arrow and select the appropriate member. I am selecting the top level member PSS Global descendants of this particular entity. Include the member also that means 1000 also appears on the report. Click OK. Again click OK. Now instead of book point of view we have selected a function. Let's save this book. I am saving this book as is underscore all entities in the explore now this new book appears right click and say open in complete book in pdf new book results appear as shown here table of contents and book name and all entities list appears in this page now you can click on any particular page number to go to that particular entity i want to see the report for 2101 and the next page contains 3000 entity and next page 3100 entity. This is how we can generate an output for all entities together using a single report. This is very useful option. Thank you for watching. We'll see you in next session.